Uh, this the beard rap, yo. Yeah. I remember when I was 18. On my face, I couldn't grow a thing. Now that I am 20, my beard is a part of me. Uh, people comment all the time telling me to shave it, but I'm not shaving it. Quit hating. Uh, my beard is getting really long. Reminds me of my big ding dong. Yeah. I like my beard, I love my beard, I grow it out for a year if I wanna. You may not like it, but ask your mama. Look at all you hating people in the comments. Uh, worry about you, don't worry about me. You know why? My beard looks good on me. Uh, that's the beard rap. Yeah, man forget you. Tizzy Ty, I'm out. Peace. I <laughs> hope you guys like that. Uh, that was my beard rap. I, I was bored and I kept reading comments of people hating on my beard. So I wrote it and I recorded it and it was fun. Uh, I'm sitting here uh, heating up some pizza uh, so I can have some in my belly so I can take my antibiotics. Uh, and then I'm probably going to head to the skate park for a little bit. Uh, shred it up. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I have planned for today. Skate, skate, skate. That's what I do every day. And maybe even write some, some more rap songs for you guys if you want to see it. If you want to. Maybe an album coming out soon. Maybe. What is that from? Is that from Shrek? I think that's from Shrek. I've been singing it like consistently as I was getting ready. Hi, yeah, hello, good morning, or whatever. Um, it's been in my head and I can't get it out. And I couldn't figure out where it's from. I think it's from Shrek, now that I think about it. Well, I've been thinking about it. Anyway, I also have, let's talk about sex, baby. Let's talk about you and me. Let's talk about all the good things and the bad things that may be for. What? You really don't like my singing? Oh, let's talk about sex, baby. Wow. Let's talk about you and me. Let's talk about all the good things and the bad things that may be. Wow. Oh, <laughs> yeah, you're funny. Uh, it's a blunt slide shove out. I just learned those the other day you know, when me and Johnny were here. Glad I got it on video. That's probably the nicest one I've done too. Uh. Alright, can I just get a large dollar tea? Yeah, one at a time. Alright. skate session. Gotta have me some sweet tea. Guys, you're always commenting on Ty's beard. What about my beard? Nobody ever comments on my beard. I like Ty's beard. He could brush it maybe, but I like it, so shush. And Ty, I like that rap. That was pretty hot. Oh yeah. I'll give you, have my people call your people and, you know, we can do things. By the way, there's a dragonfly. Right, you can't see him. There he is. Right there. He got in the house. I don't know how actually Chance let him in. Why can't teleportation be real? Like, why can't I just go... And then right when I open my eyes, I'm in a new place. Wherever I want to go, just snap my fingers and I go there instantly. That'd be so awesome. If I could, right now, snap my fingers and I would be with the gray. And then I'd snap my fingers and then come back here whenever I wanted to. And then I'd snap my fingers and go to California and go skate for the day. Why can't that be a thing? Why? Why? I want it. I want that. Can somebody please make teleportation a thing? Please. Right now, I'm standing around waiting for my mother to pick me up because I'm going to go to the rehab center. My dad's leaving the hospital and going to the rehab center. Unfortunately, there's not really anything that can be done. Uh, ultimately, it's, it's him that has to make that decision. And it's going to be a really rough decision. Uh, let me just kind of give you a little update in a sense of what's going on with my dad. He is... Can you stop? I'm trying to talk to the people of the internets and the world. Um, he, it's just, he's not really sick. He's sick, he has problems in his body, but that's just 
kind of natural. I feel like it's almost as if it's old age, but I know it is his heart and it's just his body and parts just kind of slowly failing or dying and kind of situation. So our options with him right now is rehab and hospice. You can look up hospice, I'm not explaining it if you're curious to know what it is. But um, we're gonna hope that he can kind of make some kind of like recovery in a sense to get moving in rehab and then I think he's gonna come home and my mom and I are gonna do hospice here. <laughs> it's gonna be tough. So you guys are kind of like along for the ride. Um, yeah, you're gonna see a lot of changes in me. I know that there's, there's just gonna be a lot. It's gonna be a roller coaster, so prepare yourself, strap in, cause I'm trying to. Rain, rain, go away. Don't come back again another day. So uh, I'm heading to wherever my mom's going uh, to see a new house. Uh, that she's been looking at and she wants to buy. I think she said, um, I, I talked to my sister on the phone, she said my grandma was coming also. I think she's seen it before, she's looking at it again to make her final decision. I feel like she's rushing into it and when you buy a house, I don't think you should rush at all. Uh, but we're gonna go see it, hopefully I'll get to go. I don't, like I'm, I'm running behind because uh, I think they're about to leave from her work to go uh, look at it. So hopefully I can meet up with them to go see it uh, and help her make her decision on buying it also. Uh, but yeah. We're going to get it going a real uh, episode of House Hunter today. It's going to be fun. Yeah. <laughs> and maybe I'm hoping that uh, going to look at a house she's wanting to buy will inspire me to also want to move and get my lazy butt up and actually start looking for places. <laughs> Not buying a house, but just finding somewhere new to live. I have no friends! Yeah! I miss Ty. I want to teleport and go see him and hug him. I'm not horny, guys. Why do people think I'm horny? Just because I say I miss him or I seem lonely. Doesn't mean I'm horny. Get your minds out of the gutter. This is the kitchen. <laughs> kind of like goes around a corner. This is what I'll do when I sit down here. Yeah, this kitchen is like like too cramped. I like the way the kitchen shaped. Cause like, look, if you yeah. see this, oh, it's like open at the top. Yeah, and like, I'd rather just there not be a wall there. It's just at all. Shape. There's a living room. I don't like it. Oh, I don't like it. It's just a basic little house. There's nothing special about it. Like, you want an open living room and an open kitchen. So that first house we looked at, I did not like it at all. It was like way out in the middle of nowhere. Uh, and this other house we're going to, we're going to look at the second house uh, that I guess is on top of our list. It's also way out in the middle of nowhere. Like, we're already getting out into nowhere and we're not even there yet. So, I don't know. It's that realtor lady. I don't like her. She did not seem like she knew her stuff. Like when we were asking her questions and stuff, she was like, uh, I guess, uh, sure. Like she didn't know the, like if you're a realtor, you're supposed to know, what you, you're supposed to be on it. You're supposed to be like, like knowing all the facts about the house, everything about it. You need to be able to tell us in from in everything about the house. And that woman just couldn't do it. I don't know. I feel like my mom's getting rushed into it because this woman was just trying to sell a house. So I'm kind of glad I'm with her. I don't want her to get like talked into buying a house just to buy it. Like you buy, when you buy a house, one thing that I know that I've learned, and Gray's mom has told me this and stuff like that, is you buy a house for the location. Even if it's not that great of a house, you buy it for the location. Location is more important than the house itself. Obviously, you don't want to go buy a run down house, but the location is always most important because that's what will sell a house. People want to live in a good location. And these places she's taking us to, because my mom doesn't want to spend a ton of money, uh, is not in good locations because she's wanting her to save money or she's wanting to be in a certain budget. Uh, but yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I don't like this realtor lady. But we'll see, I'm gonna go look at the second house. I'm not gonna judge it before I see it, but uh, so far I already don't like the direction we're heading in. Look, Mama, there's a turtle. He's a little turtle. What are you doing? Hi, Hi. what you doing? Oh, you can see his little eye. Hey, little one. What you doing, little turtle? <laughs> He's so cute. Hi. She talks to animals all the time. She'll literally sit there and talk to a deer. She'll go, hey, little deer, how are you doing? It's okay. Mom, what it's a doing? shell. It doesn't feel that. It does. It's his body. Not as much. Hi. 
Hi, Don't baby. touch his little feet. He doesn't know you. He does now. <laughs> Hi, baby. What you doing? I feel like he's he was trying to get underneath this thing. Probably. You know what, buddy? Should we put him over there underneath the little bushes? Mm -hmm. See if I'm, you can pick him up. You want to touch him? I don't really want to touch a little angry Come poor here, little turtle. Oh my goodness! Okay. Look at him. How oh, are you? He well, looks so a little angry. angry. <laughs> oh, you're a good boy. Good girl. <laughs> you don't know what you want. I think you're a girl. How do you know? You know turtle sexes? Yep, I think she's a girl. It's a girl. She's a girl. And I think what she's doing is she's getting ready to make her eggs. <gasps> you gotta lay eggs. We're gonna have the baby turtles. Yay! You tied it was like, you're a loser for liking your turtle. I might have beans in my teeth. I don't know. Yeah, we just looked at the second house. I didn't even feel like videoing it. It, it was so small inside. The, the door, like as they were painting it or whatever, to cover it up, one of the doors in the house where they hadn't painted it yet was literally like yellow because of uh, cigarette smoke. That house is 100. Not the range. The house is 136,000, and it needed the the floors needed to be redone. There, she wanted a deck on the back of the house for 136,000. Like the house we used to live in. If you guys remember that big house, the houses in North Carolina are really cheap compared to other places. We could have bought that house for 180,000. Well, she doesn't need a house nowhere near that big. But for the amount this woman, it, like for 136,000, what? That's freaking crazy. You can get a way nicer house than that. It's gonna be hard for me to like wanna buy a house anywhere unless it's really just for like an, a future investment because I'm not gonna wanna live anywhere for more than like a couple years at most. And that's like, that's what's hard for me like and I'm gonna tell her this once we talk because I didn't really get to talk in front of the real estate lady. But like, think about it. You're buying a house, you're gonna be living in that house for a long time. Do you really wanna live in a house? Like when you buy a house, you want to love you want to love the house. So you'll want to continue living in it. And I just uh I mean I know I'm not I'm not the one buying the house, but I wouldn't buy the house. I wouldn't live in either one of these houses if somebody gave them to me. I would sell them, but I wouldn't want to live in them. I like my house better than, than, than these houses, and I hate my house. I hate the house I'm living in. My my house, you guys have seen it. My house is nicer than both of these houses you just showed us. And my house is like over 100 years old. Guys, these clouds are looking mean, and there's a tornado warning. Ominous. Oh, spelling. no. Ominous. I remember doing that in, I think, middle school or high school. Wow, that looks really creepy and scary. We might die. Just saying. This is how you know my mom is a dental hygienist. She carries around a toothbrush in her purse. If you buy mint oh, chocolate, pick on <laughs> if you buy mint chocolate after you get Italian food, it's like the Olive Garden. I usually have my stuff. Let's go. Ugh, so full. We just ate some Italian food. We talked to my mom and she's kind of thinking now she may wait a little bit, uh, take some time off from looking at houses because she's just been looking at so many houses lately. Uh, so she take a little bit of time off, give it some like thought, and then go back to looking again because right now she's not finding anything she likes. And when you buy a house, you want to buy something you like. You don't want to just buy a house just because you're ready to buy a house. You want to take time and find something that you like. They should put me on HGTV, son. I will get some people in some nice houses. I will hook them up, son. Uh, Re-litter tie. Let's do it. I'm gonna start selling houses. What do you guys think? So we are at the rehab center now. They're planning, they have to like, she's doing the uh, food for him. And I may or may not be scavenging off of what my dad does not eat. <laughs> it's rice pudding. Katie, if you're watching, you would love this if you don't already, but I don't have a spoon, so. Can I try turkey bacon? Turkey bacon's really good. Nom nom nom. He's relaxing. Do you want to try oatmeal with blueberries? Oh. My grandma gave my mom this when we were looking at houses. It's a list that she wrote when she was like a kid uh, for what she wants in a house. It says my my want list. It says number one, shady yard. Number two, no congestion. What? Congestion. What do you mean? Probably okay. busy roads. Yeah. Number three, porch. Front porch. Deck on back. Sliding doors. Fence. Storage building. Fireplace. Kitchen. Dining room. Or living room combination. Close together. Dishwasher. Wait, what do you mean close together? Like together, I guess. I don't know. 
Uh, I wanted a dishwasher because we didn't have a dishwasher when I was growing up. They was uh, poor? No, we weren't poor. Closet space. Did they have dishwashers then? They did, yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Some people did. Bathroom and master bedroom. Cable hook up in all rooms. <laughs> yeah, you know this is written a while back ago. <laughs> Two or three bedroom, more or less three. One extra bathroom, duh. <laughs> Master bed, big. Laundry room, duh. Good sized backyard, basement, heating and air conditioning, because we didn't have that when I was young. <laughs> <laughs> they were poor. No, we didn't have central heat and air. We had window units and fans. That was my fish list, and I'll let you look at it. That was when I was little. How how old do you think you were when you wrote that? What? That's good handwriting. You had to be at least like 13, 14, I'd say. Probably, or I wouldn't have known to even <laughs> want that stuff. But that's a good list. There you go. Follow that list. <laughs> Man, if I had a list from like that when I was like 13 or 14, it'd have a lot different stuff than that. <laughs> it probably wouldn't even mention. If it mentioned a house, it'd just be like, I just have a real big ass house somewhere. This is how long I've been wanting to buy a house since I was a little kid. Don't look bad. I'm. I'm hearing a lot of YouTubers that have uh, their power, that, uh, YouTubers in New Jersey that have had their power go off because of the storm. It's like really, really rainy and lightning and thundering. And the clouds are moving so fast. Ooh, might not make it home. Just kidding, we'll make it home, but still, scary. I love storms though. They're fun. And blackouts are fun too. But I need the internet. I really, really like this feature. I never got this before, but emergency... Okay. Emergency alert, flood, flash flood warnings in this area. I like that. And I went back to iOS 6 because I couldn't do it. But yeah, the storm's scary. My mom buys the cheapest toilet paper. Look at this. This is not even toilet paper. Look at that. It floats from the vent. That is not toilet paper. I'm gonna give my mom a five dollar bill. So when I come over here, I'll actually have decent toilet paper to use. Yeah, you buy crappy toilet paper. Alyssa, I can't even wipe my butt with Alyssa that. Picked it out. You gotta buy the good stuff. Toilet paper is something you need quality in. You want it to be an enjoyable experience when you wipe between your butt cheeks. I remember when I was eight. On my face, I couldn't grow a thing, but now I am 20. My beard is a part of me. <laughs> it's the country raising, guys. If you ever need an emergency tripod for a little camera like this, take the lampshade off of a, a light like this. Worked at our house, and I knew it was going to work here, and it did. That's what you guys are just sitting on. You're sitting right on that. You're screwed onto that. Ew, you guys are nasty. When I was 13, <laughs> I couldn't shave my legs. Ew. I mean, Tim, when I was 10, I couldn't shave my legs. And then my friends all came over for my birthday party, and Ashley came over and taught me how to do it. On my 10th birthday, I shaved my legs. That was the worst song I've ever heard in history. <laughs> hey, boo. Hey, boo. What you doing? You eating some food? You eating some food, boo? Hello. How are you doing? Don't you get them grapes all over me. Don't you grab my camera. Don't you grab my camera. <coughs> Poke your belly. <coughs> hey, boo. Quit grabbing the camera. You dropped your grape. You dropped it. Look. Here you go. Boo. Boo. And he's gone. Let's play throw the monkey. Throw the monkey. Boo! Yay! Jump! 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 Huh. Ready? 360. Come <laughs> Jump! Jump! He keeps looking at that camera. Jump! Oh. <laughs> Are you ready? We gotta do 360 this time. Tyler, be careful. Two. Three. Boo! Jump. And 360. Oh, that was almost 
Alright, what's up? 540, boo. Go look in the camera, you're not getting it. I'm gonna try to turn around. Look at him. I knew it. You're not you're not getting it, boo. Forget you. Smarty. Jump. That's so crazy. It don't matter where he lives, he finds places to jump. That's so crazy. He jumps from that onto the door frame and slides down. <laughs> <laughs> he swings the doors. Good boy. I love to be a monkey. It'd be so fun. It is. All right. I got the monkey here. Teach you guys how to make a burrito. You just put him down. You roll him up. They will try to squirm. It's all right. You just gotta roll them up. You gotta tuck it in. There we go. They'll slide out on you. <laughs> we gotta make a burrito. Hold still. It's a burrito. And there you go. There's your monkey burrito. <laughs> just like that. That's cute. Can we get a close up of the burrito? Let's get a close up. He's a nasty. Right. He can't stand sitting still like this. Drives him nuts. He can't stand it. He's so hyper. This burrito is pretty quick. <laughs> No cooking evolved, you just wrap it up. <laughs> you eat them raw. This is one of those five minute family meals. <laughs> yeah. This is Ty's cooking channel. Yeah, hold him down. Grab him up, and then you go and grab him. You spin him, there we go. There's a good burrito right there. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's how you like it right he's there. He's got one arm free, but he's, he's getting out. <laughs> All right, I'll leave you alone. <laughs> he turns around makes a face. So it is 11 o'clock at night. We're leaving. Um, I'm gonna drive home. I've never driven this car before, so I'm nervous. But yeah, that's what up our day has been. Just that's do do the rehab center. Huh? Oh, they got some pretty flowers. You know the nurses here are just like, what is she doing? Why is she filming herself? Perfect. I like books. This will be fun. And then I'm gonna try and get home so that Ty and I can have a little Skype date. Probably not, but I mean, I can hope, right? Just depends on the time that I get back, so yeah. Hey. Hi. Skype chatting with Grizzy Gray. Hee hee. I miss you. I miss you too. Wait, can we see if Mac's gonna respond? Yes. Mac! <laughs> Just keep saying Mac, he's in another room. Do it. He's not coming. When you felt you fell asleep the other night, and I was tapping like that on the thing, and I think I got him to come up and added like the couch or whatever he was <laughs> sleeping on. It was cute. <laughs> but yeah, hi. Hey. I miss you. I miss you too. Hopefully, we get to see each other soon. Mm-hmm. And he hopes so too. And I'm not horny, everybody. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog there. Thank you for watching, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the vlog. Click the like button down below if you enjoyed it. Subscribe for new videos Monday through Friday. And I'll let Gray end it. Bye, guys. We'll see you tomorrow. 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 Nope. nope. Monday. I'm... We'll see you Monday, you beautiful little thing, you. Peace. <laughs> I wanted to quickly add this in. Uh, if you guys live in the Raleigh slash Cary area of North Carolina and you want to meet me, uh, Tim is going to a YouTube gathering there. Uh, so he asked me to come along if I wanted to because he's driving the Fiesta. It's free gas. So I was like, you know what? Why not? I don't have anything else to do on a Saturday. Uh, so if you guys aren't doing anything on Saturday and you live in that area and you want to come eat us, uh, you can come out. I'll put the link in the description down below. I don't really know. I'm not putting on this gathering or anything like that. Uh, but I will go. So if you want to meet me and you live in the area, check the link in the description, and I will see you there. Yeah, bye.